What's up guys, I'm here with two ice cream reviews. We have the new Lucky Charms ice cream and the new Cinnamon Toast Crunch ice cream. Here's the Lucky Charms ice cream close up there. I've heard about these for quite a while. Gosh, maybe like a month or so on social media. And here's the Cinnamon Toast Crunch. So yeah, I was pretty excited to try these out because I mean, who wouldn't want to try out Lucky Charms Ice Cream and Cinnamon Toast Crunch. So I found these at my local Hy-Vee grocery store. I've been finding quite a bit of stuff at Hy-Vee lately. They are, they were $3.99 each for these at Hy-Vee, which is not too bad. It's not too bad for ice cream. And they are made by uh, Briars, Nestle, not Briars, Dryers, Nestle Dryers Ice Cream Company. And it's funny because the Lucky Charms, it says frozen dairy dessert, but the Cinnamon Toast Crunch says light ice cream. So I don't really know what a frozen dairy dessert, it looks like ice cream, but it's not called ice cream. So let's see, first up, I'm gonna head and try the Lucky Charms. So it says, Vanilla frozen dairy dessert with a cereal swirl and Lucky Charms marshmallows. So it has a cereal swirl through the ice cream and then just the Lucky Charms marshmallows are inside it. So let me open it up here. It's kind of melting already. I've had it out for a minute here, trying to set up for the review. I should have put them in the freezer, but then I took a picture of them and everything. So this is what it looks like when I open up the package. You can see the marshmallow pieces in there. I don't really see a swirl yet. Let me scoop some out here. Let's see what it looks like. I'll show you close up real quick. So that's what it looks like close up when I scooped it out. I still don't see a swirl. I just see the ice, well the dairy dessert, frozen dairy dessert. They're not calling it ice cream. Looks like ice cream though. And then you see the marshmallow pieces and that's what it looks like. When I scooped it out of there, you still don't see any swirl. I just see the marshmallows. Doesn't smell like anything. No, it just smells like vanilla ice cream. All right, let me try it out here. So I taste the marshmallows. It's not bad. It's actually pretty good. I like it. It reminds me, it's kind of like a vanilla ice cream, but kind of not. It does kind of have like a cereal taste to it. I almost want to say like a, like a milky, like the milk in the cereal, once the cereal is in there and you get that kind of a, the milk flavor with the cereal ap afterwards, but like turned into like a dairy dessert. That's kind of what it reminds me of. It's different, but it's good. It's got a little bit of like a cinnamon, a touch of like a, not real strong cinnamon, but like just a touch of, of like cinnamon in there maybe. But the marshmallow pieces, let me try to get another marshmallow. They're not real. Okay, yeah. When, they, when I taste them by themselves, when I scooped it out, I could get the, like the, you know, um, the sponginess of the marshmallow, but like when you when they're down in mixed into the ice cream, you don't quite taste the sponginess of the of the marshmallow as much. Let me try it again here. Yes, I'm eating out of the container. I know. You, you can get the marshmallow, but it's not as spongy as if you like pick it out of the top and you eat it by itself. Yeah. 
when you when it's mixed down to the ice cream, it's not as spongy like as it is <laughs> as on the top when I just pick it out. That's pretty good. It's similar to ice cream, but it's not like it. Maybe because it's a frozen dairy dessert is why it tastes a little bit different. Whatever frozen dairy dessert exactly is. It's pretty good. I I don't know if it tastes like Lucky Charms necessarily. I mean, it, I said it did taste like the milk that's in there. Kind of gives me that vibe a little bit. The marshmallows you kind of taste. The marshmallows aren't super strong flavor. You get the kind of sweetness from the marshmallow, but it's not. I think they could have made the marshmallow pieces maybe a little bit bigger because they're pretty small. And then when they're mixed in with the ice cream, you don't taste the, the kind of spongy texture of a marshmallow. So it kind of, it leaves you from the sweetness, but it doesn't feel exactly like it's a marshmallow. I don't know, it's good though, but um, out of five, what would I give this? I'm gonna say like a three and a half out of five. It's good. Um, but not like spectacular. All right, next we'll try the Cinnamon Toast Crunch. This one says cinnamon light ice cream with a cinnamon gram swirl and cereal pieces. So this one is ice cream and it's got a cinnamon gram swirl and then it has um, cereal pieces in there. So it should have Cinnamon Toast Crunch cereal pieces mixed in there in this ice cream. Okay, this is what this looks like close up. I don't see real big cereal pieces there. Not yet anyway. Just maybe when I dig into it, I'll notice it. Let me scoop a little bit out here. Okay, I see the swirl definitely in this one. Show you close up here. So you can see, definitely see the swirl in the middle there, that dark swirl, but I don't see any of the cereal pieces. That's what it looked like when I scooped it out of the ice cream. You still see more of that swirl there, but I'm not seeing much cereal pieces. We'll see when I dig into the ice cream a little bit more when I try it out if I come across any cereal pieces. All right. Oh, I forgot to smell it. Yeah, I smell, I smell, oh, I think I got it on my nose. I smell cinnamon in this one a little bit. Mmm. It's good. Definitely has that cinnamon toast crunch flavor to it, definitely. Mmm, okay. I just got a big cereal piece. That's really good. Mmm. That swirl in there is so good. I'm trying to see if I can find another cereal piece so I can show you. I don't know if that's the swirl or the cereal piece. Mm, that was that was a cereal piece. Mm, it's crunchy. It's hard to I can't I'm gonna have to dig into the thing again. Sorry. I know some people hate that when you eat out of the cereal container or the ice cream container I can't see any of the cereal pieces but when I bite into it I bite into it. it's like they're hidden way into the ice cream but when you bite into it you get them ah, there's not any there they don't have a lot of them I'm not finding any of them anymore. Oh, there's one. So there's a cereal piece right there. If you can see it, that piece right there, that's a cereal piece. It's crunchy when you bite into it. There's not a lot. Well, I kind of had to dig around there, but there might be more. The more we get into the cereal and we eat it, there might be more of those down inside the cereal a little bit more. So yeah, this is good. It kind of reminds me of a cinnamon roll a little bit. It has kind of a cinnamon roll vibe. This ice cream is all melting here. Because, yeah, because of the cinnamon swirl and the cinnamon, um, it's very much like a cinnamon roll. And I love cinnamon roll ice cream. It's probably why I love this one. 
That's what it reminds me of. But, you do get that flavor of the cinnamon toast crunch because the cereal pieces in there too. You know, it, that's what makes it a little bit more like cinnamon toast crunch because you get those crunchy cinnamon uh, toast crunch pieces. I just hope there's more in there once we digged into it, a little bit more of those crunchy cereal pieces. It's not super, super crunchy, but just, you know, kind of like a, like a cereal piece would be. Um, a little bit more like before you get it totally soaked in milk, it's a little bit more uh, crunchy. So yeah, this one's good. Out of five, this one, I give this one, I say like a four and a half out of five. I think this one's really good. I think I prefer this one better. Let me try this one last time. Now see, that's really good. That's good too. I like them both. I just love ice cream. What can I say? That almost, the sugariness from the marshmallows kind of comes off a little cotton candy like. It has a little bit of a sugary cotton candy vibe going on in there with those marshmallow pieces. That's pretty good. They're both really good. I definitely recommend checking them out. This one here actually is just a little bit fewer calories. It says uh, it's got five grams of fat and then um, 2.5 grams of saturated fat. The Cinnamon Toast Crunch has six grams of fat and 3.5 grams of saturated fat. Even though it is a light ice cream though, it says it's half the fat one third fewer calories than full fat ice cream. So there's that anyway. At least you're getting light ice cream instead of full fat ice cream. So check them out. Lucky Charms Frozen Dairy Dessert and Cinnamon Toast Crunch Light Ice Cream. Like I said, I found them at our local Hy-Vee grocery store. So hopefully you are able to find them hopefully soon at your local grocery store. So thanks for watching and we'll see you in our next video. Bye.